Good morning, everyone, and welcome to St. Philip's News You Can Use. Today is Friday, September 10th, 2010, and I'm your guest host for the week, Miss York. Starting off with our top story, how much fun have you been having at recess? Mr. Barnes and Miss Sykes worked with a really great organization called Playworks over the summer, and they learned lots of new games. All of the teachers spent some time playing the games together last week so we could learn the rules and have a little fun, too. You've already learned a few of these games this week, and we have even more to show you. We're very excited to see which ones you decide are your favorites. If you play any of these games at home this weekend, make sure to let us know. Every Friday, we're going to share something interesting that's happening in one of our classrooms. This Friday, we're going to share some news from Miss Gellerstein's second grade class, who are doing something very interesting after recess. They are finding their inner peace. Every day after lunch and recess, Mrs. Gellerstein's class spends 15 minutes sitting quietly and collecting their thoughts. This is a great activity that helps them refresh for the rest of the afternoon. This weekend is another great time to refresh yourself during a busy school year. Take a moment this weekend to make sure you have a good place at home to study and do your homework. Here are some tips to consider when setting up your space. Make sure it is a quiet spot so you can focus. Keep the TV off during homework time. Keep your eyes and your body awake. It may be helpful to close the books for a few minutes, stretch, and take a break from time to time. Now let's look at what's going on today. Here is today's weather. Today's lunch will be whole wheat cheese quesadilla with brown rice. For soup, we have Cuban black beans, and for dessert, peach crisp. Did you know that today in history, tennis great Steffi Graf of West Germany won the U.S. Open women's final in 1988? Steffi was very busy then. She won the Grand Slam title, the Olympic gold medal, and an amazing 96% of her matches all in one year. She must have practiced a lot. For more information, visit the Today in History page at thinkfinity.org. That's all the news for now. Tune in on Monday for our next segment of St. Philip's News You Can Use. Have a great Friday.